Welcome Pisces to Amore Bella Tero. Um, thank you for letting me enter into your space. I am truly enjoying bringing forth some free entertainment. This is a bonus reading for the first week of May. Beautiful Pisces, spirits of peace and love. Do like, share, subscribe, and comment. Um, Pisces, I uh, need that stimulation to continue to be motivated to come forth with this uh, fun game. Okay, one more. This is for beautiful Pisces, spirits of peace and love. What is Pisces? What guidance and information do our Pisces need to hear for this first week of May? Spirits of peace and love. Now, no, it's not going to... Um, Recite with the masses, Pisces, so take what recites and leave the rest. If you would like a personal reading, I am available for that as well. So do look at the link down below, okay? Thank you so much. And here we have at the bottom of the deck, um, Pisces, you have the Five of Fire. The Five of Fire in traditional tarot is the Five of Wands, which represents um, a little bit of arguing and uh, fighting, battle. Um, we'll clarify but that's just anything. Spirits of peace and love, what does Pisces need to hear for this beautiful first week of May? And it seems like it's we're going back to normality slowly but surely here, Pisces. So uh, God is good. Spirits of peace and love, what does Pisces need to hear for this first week of May? Still continue to take the proper... You know, continue to wash your hands and, and cover your mouth and try to be cautious out there still, Pisces. You know, let's not just be... We've been in cage for quite some time for reasons, so let's not ruin all the work that we've done by staying home and ruining it in one day. All right, Pisces, spirits of peace and love. What does Pisces need to hear? For this first week of May, we have the Ten of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Um, and a, a lot of pain. Um, uh, somebody is stabbed you in the back here, Pisces, ten times. That is the end, though. You have learned your lessons, Pisces, and you are going to become a different person because of that pain that you overcame, okay? What does not kill us makes us stronger is a fact here, Pisces, but we will clarify. Sometimes the card says one thing and the clarification changes the story 100%. So let's just wait till the spread is complete before we make any decisions here, uh, Pisces. All right, spirits of peace and love. What does Pisces need to hear for the first week of May? Spirits of peace and love. We have romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring, Pisces. That's beautiful. That's at the bottom of your romantic angel deck. Okay, let's get the party started, Pisces. Okay, let's continue. All right, spirits of peace and love. What do our Pisces need to hear for this first week of May, Father Almighty? All right, let's start. Here we go. We have the seven of earth. Pisces, this is your first energy um, coming forth, and it's the Seven of Earth. So you have a Seven of Pentacles. So you're working hard on your money here, Pisces. Um, just You don't see any fruit yet, but you see that it's coming, okay? It's like you, you, you know it's coming. Uh, yes, beautiful, beautiful, Pisces. The full new beginnings, leap of faith. Um, trying something new here Pisces but definitely a new a new beginning either work wise or a new beginning love wise but you're definitely taking on a leap of faith here Pisces and your last card here it's the page of air that is the page of swords um, somebody's spying on you maybe um, Pisces maybe you're spying on somebody else we're going to pull this other card because it's standing out to me. Yeah, you have some temptations here. Um, somebody is uh, somebody is lurking here. Um, Pisces, somebody's checking up on your media, driving by your house. This is my um, 
uh, how do you call it, my, <laughs> just somebody who's spying, checking up on your media, Pisces, just somebody who's very uh, lustful for you here, Pisces, so be careful. And at the bottom of the deck, you have the Three of Wands. So you're waiting for your ships to come in here, um, Pisces. You know that something grand is on the horizon and you're waiting for it. All right, let's clarify. Okay, let's clarify the Seven of Pentacles. So you're, you're working hard. You, you've, you've, you've planted a lot of seeds here and your fruit is coming forth here, um, King of Wands. This king is very stable, very passionate. Um, very intelligent, okay. So it's it, a king. There's no gender in uh, gender is not relevant in um, tarot. That's just a very stable, solid, mature, mature person coming forth here. Okay, let's see. And then you have the seven of pentacles again in the same placement. Um, so you're just, just working really hard here, Pisces. You're just focusing on your coins, focusing on your money, focusing on your uh, future. Okay, Pisces, good job. Yep, more money, more coins, more new beginnings, new be new a new job, a new uh, ideas on how to make money. A lot of people have um, <clears throat> evolved to some entrepreneur ways since we've been encaged for this long. But look, new beginnings in love. This is true love, Pisces. This is equal, equal love. You know, equal give and take in partnership. But it's truthful. Okay, that is a like a soulmate. Clarify this Two of Cups for us. We're a beautiful Pisces, Spirits of Peace and Love. We have the Queen of Wands. Um, again, Wands, that's the power couple here. You have the King and the Queen. Um, very passionate, very beautiful, very abundant, very solid, very sexual. Okay, a lot of physical contact coming out for everybody, okay? Oh, wow. And then we have the Wheel of Fortune. So this is what you deserve. You've karmically cleansed your, your you've paid your debts here, Pisces, and the good, the abundance is coming your path here, Pisces. That's beautiful. And we have the Three of Pentacles, more Pentacles, man. You're just focusing on your money. You, you, you're going to come ahead here, um, Pisces, but you're just working hard on your coins. But there's true love true love coming your way and here this uh clarifies spirits of peace and love this um <clears throat> page of page of swords with the devil here we have a temptation we have yeah somebody's being deceitful somebody thinks they're so smart somebody thinks they're so slick okay people like that yeah, okay, let's clarify this seven of swords for a beautiful Pisces. Yeah, no, see? Mm -mm. They could stay over there. Ace of Wands, more passion, more new passionate beginnings, people, okay? Pisces, beginnings. Not take backs, okay? Not somebody who we know is lustful and, and who is deceiving and who is uh, stalking and who is, uh, yeah, no more new beginnings and passion for you because look you've gone through the ringer and you're different you see things differently you know what you want now pisces you know what you deserve and you will not you will not tolerate anything to do with the devil the seven of swords deceiving thievery and um spying you will not tolerate that any longer pisces that's so beautiful May has been good to all of us. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Okay, let's clarify this hangman for Pisces. Yeah, see, now you have many options, Pisces, because you are bountiful, you are beginning, you know you look good, you're taking care of yourself, and you have a lot of offers here, Pisces, okay? But out of all those offers, there's the right one, and you will pick the correct one because you have gone within. 
you've gone through the ringer. And look, you are in a person, you know what, you, what passion, what brings you joy, what brings you new beginnings here in passion. And you will not tolerate this any longer, Pisces. That is a beautiful, beautiful spread here, Pisces. I love it. May is magical. Let's pull one more card. What is the seven of the cups here? All this outburst of love coming forth to our beautiful Pisces. Spirits of peace and love we have, yeah? Yeah, somebody's coming in. Somebody's coming in. And you will... That deceitful person wants to continue to come back. But look, no sirree, Bob. Mm -mm. He keeps trying to come back. And he, it's, it's a vicious circle here, Pisces, okay? It's a vicious circle, but you are no longer because you have the sun card here. This is the happiest card in the deck, Pisces. So you... You know your value. You know what you want. You're abundant. You're not going to accept this uh, this sinful person who continues, continues to come drain your energy, continues to pop in whenever you're moving on with all your money. And yeah, no more. Look, no more fighting. No more fighting for you, Pisces. Mm -mm. You're done. You've evolved. You've grown to a different person and you will not accept and tolerate any of that nonsense. All right. Spirits of peace and love. Ah, angel, romantic angels, what do we need to know about the seven of earth for our Pisces? Working hard on your money, Pisces. Yeah, yes. Okay, you have forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. Yes, yes, Pisces. So forgiving. Okay, let's forgive ourselves. Let's forgive ourselves. Sometimes... We have to learn to forgive ourselves for our past doings, Pisces, so we could um, know that we deserve a higher, higher level of companionship. Um, there's the physical companionship, and then there's the physical and mental give and take companionship, and that's what we deserve here, um, Pisces, and then we have here on the new beginnings, yes, yes, passion, passion, new passionate beginnings coming forth for our beautiful Pisces. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Yes, new passionate beginnings for you here, Pisces. Now, I know that this is not going to recite with masses, but do take what recites and leave the rest. Okay, Pisces, and here on this page of this person who's lustful and keeps coming in and out into your life Pisces what do we need to know spirits angels okay we have yeah see that's what they bring forth to the table do we want this anymore Pisces no ma'am because we have evolved to a higher self we have gone through the ringer here where is it where is it here we have gone through the ringer we have gone within we know that that person is codependent, okay? And they're never going to be committed. And we know what we deserve here, Pisces, the sun. Chicka bum bum, chicka bum 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 bum. Yeah, we are just going to let this codependency individual go ahead and move ahead in their own ways. Get their lessons wherever their lessons are to be theirs. And hopefully they overcome that. But you, Pisces, you, 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 yes, you've evolved. You're, you're going to get your new beginnings. This is a beautiful spread, Pisces. Blessings. And do like, share, subscribe, and comment to continue to stimulate me coming forth. Thank you. Blessings.